Hello, my name is Mark Schwartzbauer and I represent Road Rescue. The question you have to ask yourself is Road Rescue the fit for your department? If you don't want to compromise safety, then yes, Road Rescue is the right fit for your department. So how do we incorporate the safety into our modules? We have our crew guard body. We engineer our crew guard body with reinforced quarter inch plating, miter gusseted tubing, and also curved force formed aluminum corner panels. In addition to that, our exclusive ladder frame subfloor superstructure. That gives you an overall increased strength, durability, and safety. So curved force uh, formed aluminum panels, what we do is we first have our box pan form body design that has a two inch bend to increase, increase the strength of the module. And then we form in this inch and a half radius into our panels. That also has a two inch bend on it also, and we have holes that we plug weld the seam together for superior strength. If you notice, we only have one vertical uh, body seam on each corner. That is 50% fewer seams than most typical ambulance manufacturers. Also on each side of the seam, we have from the roof structure down to the subfloor structure, a extruded tube that is also welded in to reinforce that corner support. Road Rescue trademark hidden hinges. Our hidden hinges create, create a sleek profile. You'll notice that we hide the, uh, the exterior compartment and entry door hinges behind our, our door skin. What that does is it gives you a nice, sleek appearance. Uh, it also protects the hinge from uh, road debris for smoother operation and also the reduction of any type of possible corrosion if it ever were to happen. In addition to Road Rescue's crew guard body and our ladder frame subfloor design, we have 12 mounting points on the chassis frame rail. The mounting points actually help disperse the energy at, at which point a worst case scenario happens, it, uh, it actually sends that energy out to mul multiple mounting points. Road Rescue's trademark Brilliance Advanced Vehicle Lighting. We have auxiliary lighting in both the rear corner panel of the rear body of the vehicle and it also has three different flash patterns that are incorporated into it to try to break up that distraction of the drivers of oncoming traffic. We also have alternating uh, red and white emergency auxiliary lights that flash down below, so entering an intersection is gonna give you that extra safety. Once you're on scene, uh, in this case, we're gonna go grab our backboard, and you'll notice that the light turns white to illuminate the ground to show you unlevelness of the ground below. Once you shut the exterior compartment door, it goes back to our additional alternating flash pattern. Road Rescue's Whisper Quiet Sound and Thermal Insulation Package. First, we start out with a sound absorption material, which uh, absorbs vibrations of larger body pan wall panels, and that creates an acoustical noise level. So what we're doing is we absorb that vibration to reduce the noise level. Over the top of that, uh, we apply half inch 3M Finsulate, and all this is being applied over all the exterior compartments and the, and the wheel well area. In addition to that, all four walls have one inch Dow Corning hardboard foam insulation and the addition of E-foil over the top of that. Our ceiling structure consists of two inch dense polystyrene insulation with E-foil over the top of that. Once the vehicle finishes its manufacturing process, we actually apply an expanded foam thermal insulation to the underside of the body. On, on top of that, we apply a thermal acoustical undercoating uh, material that helps preserve uh, the subfloor structure itself. Road Rescue offers Performax four-point seat belts with deacceleration technology. How do you keep your, your crew safe? Well, first they have to wear their seat belts or their projectile like any other thing that's in the vehicle that's not secured. So how to influence the wearing of seat belts is the flexibility of movement. As you can see, I can move and access the patient very easily and still remain seat belted in. In addition to Performax seat belts, Road Rescue offers Rolltech. Rolltech is a supplemental occupant protection system. So the, in the event of a rollover either side, these airbags are deployed to help protect you from other equipment that may be within that area. Air conditioning has always been a big concern come our hot and humid summer months. Well, we have the solution for that. So first we start out with under the cab hood, we have two AC compressors. And this can be on, a, on an F-Series chassis, a Dodge chassis, 
um, or Freightliner International. So one compressor under hood drives the cab only. The secondary compressor drives the module only, so we're keeping the system separated. So in addition to that, in the back of the module, we put two AC evaporators. Because what happens when you arrive on scene, you open up the entrance doors to the vehicle, and the vehicle gets uh, flooded with heat and humidity. How do you get rid of heat and humidity? You gotta have air recovery, right? So two, addition, uh, two auxiliary evaporators is gonna also condition the air, remove the humidity from it, and due to the volume of air that's going through the module, it's gonna give you a faster comfort recovery time. So what I have behind me here is a, is a vehicle with the side entrance door to the module is in the forward position. There's a couple of theories of why would this design work for your department. Well, as you can see, for one, side door forward gives you a lot of open space behind where the patient is being treated, behind the EMTs. So if law enforcement needs to get up in and observe the patient, they are out of the way and are able to keep the situation safe. It's also meant for an EMT supervisor. They're allowed to stand behind the scene and stay out of the EMT's way of taking care of the patient. And also new trainees, ride-alongs, it allows them to observe and stay out of the way. So our ALS, you'll notice our design is we create a suicide door. So typically this door would be hinged on the, on the other side of the vehicle and now I'd have to walk around a compartment door to be able to access. So ease of access. And so if you look through here, you can see where about the patient head is gonna be. This also gives privacy to the patient. We had a great show here at the 2022 FDIC convention. And remember, if you have any additional questions, please go to roadrescue.com, hit dealer selector, find the dealership within your area, and they will be happy to work with you and answer any additional questions that you may have. Also, don't forget to follow us on Facebook. Thank you very much.